no Secret Service agent was in that area. Normally, in a motorcade, Secret Service agents would be riding on the back of his car and run along beside him whenever the car slowed down. In Dallas, these agents were ordered to abandon their positions. They didn't agree with it, they didn't like it, but they followed their orders. Normally, there would be four motorcycles on each side of the President's limousine. This is what the Dallas police prepared for. However, all of the motorcycle police were removed from escorting the President. Two were placed on each side of the car containing the Secret Service agents, and the rest were moved to the back of the parade. Look at the people in these crowds. They are 10 and 12 deep in some places. Just before the last turn in the motorcade, we can see people are still standing five feet deep to see the President. But then the limousine turns the corner, drives 100 yards, and... What happened? Where are all the people? The killers were nearly able to completely eliminate the witnesses to their crime by excluding them from Dealey Plaza. They controlled the murder scene. They made sure that no Secret Service agent was in that area. Except for the small army of their people running around with Secret Service credentials. <laughs>